What's going on guys? Adam Snyder here with Homemade Entrepreneur. Today I want to give you my top five passive income streams of 2019. Now I'm shooting this video. It is still 2018. So whenever you watch it, you know, don't know when that's going to be. But these five passive income streams are things that I've been using for a while and I absolutely love them and I want to share them with you. All right. So let's jump into it. Now I'm going to give you an example uh, based on my weight loss channel in a little bit okay so make sure you stay tuned and watch this entire video but let's talk about what is my passive income stream okay this is my passive income stream i have other ones as well but this is one i want to share with you because it works almost every single time okay first thing i start off with youtube making money with google adsense this is my main traffic source right here okay this one right here youtube okay from there i mix in affiliate marketing and mainly recurring commissions these are things like uh, software where I get paid monthly, um, things like services, uh, again, more monthly things like bookkeeping, stuff like that. Um, and again, I don't, it's not 100% recurring, but most of it is. Course sales, these are courses that I actually sell myself. So it has nothing to do with affiliate marketing, um, or I'm not promoting anybody else's product. I have courses on stock trading, I have courses on SEO, uh, freelance writing, I have courses on affiliate marketing, I have courses on YouTube, I have courses on um, like karate, uh, self help, survival, stuff like that. Okay. So those are completely different. Ebook sales, these are things that I'm selling ebooks. Some of them are small, some of them are hosted by myself or another provider, some are hosted by Amazon and it's an Amazon Kindle ebook. Okay. And then another one is peer-to-peer -peer lending. Now, let me show you how all this comes together. So right here, YouTube, I put it in red, number one, because YouTube, their logo is red. Second reason why is because I want you to really uh, understand what YouTube is doing for all this down here, okay? Now, just bear with me, okay, that yes, you may not be interested in doing ebook sales or course sales or affiliate marketing, maybe even peer-to-peer -peer lending. No, no problem, no big deal. I'm gonna give you an example in just a second. But what I want to, to show you and talk to you about is why I love YouTube and why YouTube is the kind of the building block, the foundation of a lot of my businesses, all right? Number one, YouTube is easy traffic. You put up a video and you start building traffic, okay? You start getting traffic. You funnel that traffic from YouTube to your eBooks or to your courses or to an affiliate product that you may recommend. Okay, YouTube is, in my opinion, one of the easiest uh, places to get traffic. Yeah, there's Facebook and there's Google and there's Yahoo and Bing and there's paid advertising, but YouTube is free. You can start for free. You do not have to pay anything. Start for free and get free traffic to your offers, okay, to something. Now, you create that video one time and then you can get paid, you know, every single month, every single day, depending on how well it does. So let me give you an example. Uh, probably four and a half, five years ago, I created a video uh, on a, it's a little, uh, like a workout uh, item, okay? And so it's this, this item that you can use, you can use in your office, you can use in your home, you can use in the car, it's very simple to use, okay? I'm not going to tell you what it is, because I don't want the competition, but uh, four, four and a half, five years ago, whenever it was, I created this video, and it didn't get a lot of traffic. Uh, probably in the first uh, week or month, it probably got... Uh, under a hundred views on this video. Now it has, I think, close to like 600,000 views and it sells about two or three of this, this one product every single day. Okay. The product doesn't make me a lot of money. It makes me about $8, $9, somewhere around there. So let's just round up to 10. Let's just say $10. So on average, I make $30, 20 or $30 a day from this one video I did almost five years ago. Okay. That's how YouTube is working in my favor. Okay, so that would be an example of affiliate marketing. I'm promoting a product that's over on Amazon. Okay, and that doesn't even include if somebody buys something else. Now, course sales, let's talk about that. So a while back, probably two and a half years ago, uh, I, my wife and I, we got into watching like this survival show and we were, we were really big into it. We learned a lot about it. And so I took what I learned from watching the show, what I read, what I learned from uh, doing a couple seminars, and I put that into an online course, okay, of survival, and talking about you know building a you know a bug out bag stuff like that. Anyway, that's not the point of this video. But what I want you to understand is I took what I learned 
from this, from all this stuff that I was doing, from watching and reading and experiencing, and I put it into a course. I sell it for fourteen ninety five, okay, fourteen ninety five, uh, and it probably sells maybe three or four a week. So not a lot of money, okay. So let's say it sells four a week, okay, at fifteen dollars a piece. I'm making about sixty bucks, sixty dollars a week, okay. Was that two hundred forty dollars uh, a month? But that's something I did years ago, okay, and it's still selling. I don't do a lot of stuff to promote it. I don't talk about it that much, but it's one of those things that it's connected to a YouTube channel. The YouTube channel, which again, was done a couple years ago. I haven't done a video probably in maybe eight months to eight to 12 months, something like that. So it's still making money. That's still a passive income because I put in the work one time and I'm still making money off it. Now let's talk about ebook sales because I know one of the things so many people struggle with is, all right, if I if I'm on YouTube, you know, I'm not like I don't want to be behind the camera, I don't want to be the face of the channel. What can I do? Well, you can easily make money by doing things like you know how to's teaching moments where your the camera is just on your hands, no face, no nothing. The camera's from behind you, you know, showing your hands, and you're talking about how to fix an iPhone or whatever, something like that. All right, there's an example. So let's say you're trying to fix an iPhone. Cool. How do you do it? Well, if you have the right tools, the camera, like I said, is from behind you looking over your shoulder. Okay. It's like over the shoulder view and you're over there fixing the, the your iPhone. Maybe you're fixing the screen. You're replacing the battery, something like that. You're cleaning out the, the, you know, charging port, you know, whatever you have to do. Okay. Do something like that. But then the ebook that you can sell is, you know, how to, uh, how to restore, uh, iPhone six in, you know, to brand new condition. To factory settings, you know, whatever it is. Okay. Now it's probably not gonna sell for a lot of money. You might sell it for 99 cents, dollar ninety-nine, you know, something like that. But if it's something like, you know, how to invest a thousand dollars in the stock market, you know, yeah, step by step guide for beginners, you might be able to get you sell that for twenty nine ninety five, you know, ninety seven dollars, whatever it is, okay? Because you're teaching something that's gonna help somebody make more money. So when you're teaching somebody something that's going to help them make more money, uh, do better, uh, have a better career, uh, go further uh, in their job, stuff like that, get a raise, uh, lower their their debt, stuff like that, where it's it's financially you know motivated, you can usually sell those things for more because it is helping them either make or save more money. Okay, so you gotta keep that in mind. Now. You can see right here, peer-to-peer -peer lending is something that I don't promote from YouTube. Here's the reason why. I talk about inside some of the books that I sell, and I also talk about inside some of the courses that I sell, is if you want an additional source of income, consider peer-to-peer -peer lending. The nice thing about this is peer-to-peer -peer lending, I usually promote Lending Club. Okay. Now, there's Prosper, there's Lending Club, there's probably other ones as well. Lending Club is my main one that I, that I use and promote. So Lending Club, when somebody goes and signs up from a course or from an ebook, is actually affiliate marketing. They actually make money from that sign up. Okay? And that's pretty cool because you know if you make I think it's like fifty dollars to sign up. So if I make fifty dollars for every time somebody comes in and signs up, not only am I helping them make more money, but number two, I'm actually making more money in the whole process. And it all starts with YouTube. So as I promised, I want to give you an example and we're gonna use my weight loss channel. And again, I'm not gonna I'm not going to show you the channel. Um, some of you, I, I know some of you have seen it, but again, I'm not going to show you the channel. Um, just keep out the competition. But again, it's on weight loss and it's, it's a very specific type of weight loss. So when it comes to the weight loss channel, how do I make money? Um, Google AdSense is one. Okay. That's one income source. Now, yes, I do have over a thousand subscribers. I just crossed over that. Um, just recently, and I have way more than the 4,000 hours of watch time. It's been a channel for uh, probably five years, four years, something like that. Um, so yeah, it's been around for a while. Uh, the next thing, I do affiliate marketing with this weight loss channel, but how do I make money? How do I make it passive? Well, the, re the way I make it passive is I promote, um, it's actually a, it's a keto, it's a keto, um, I'm gonna call it cookbook, something like that, uh, but it's a recurring, commission because it's every single month this company and I don't know if keto cookbooks the, the right word or whatever but every month this company sends out a whole plan and I think it's only like it's like $15 a month or something like that 
this company sends out an entire plan, a uh, personalized plan to the person that bought it and tells them, okay, based on your criteria, based on, okay, you don't like, uh, you don't like kale, you don't like broccoli, you don't like, um, you know, whatever, okay? You hate drinking water. This is your meal plan. This is breakfast, lunch, dinner, and a few snacks, okay? And they send it out monthly. It's like $15. I think I make like, I think I make like six or seven bucks off of it every single month for every single person that's in it. That's my main uh, income source from that one. The other one is core sales. Core sales that it's a course that I put together, okay, on dieting. I'm just gonna call it dieting, okay. And the reason I'm saying dieting is because it's on keto, but it's a and again, it's a little more to it than just keto and the diet. Has a, a fitness aspe aspect to it. Has a more motivational aspect to the course, and also has a whole lifestyle aspect. How to combine everything together. Uh, that one I sell right there for twenty seven dollars. Oops. $27, $27 per sale, probably get about, I don't know, I'd say about 10, uh, 10 a month, not a day, 10 a month of just that course. It's one that I you know, promote here and there. Um, and again, it's all passive. As far as ebook sales, I promote an ebook again on the basic, um, basic understanding of keto, how to get into it, keto for beginners pretty much. And again, that one, uh, it sells on Amazon. It's not a great seller. I probably make about 15 to 20 dollars a month on that one um keto for beginners i'll say 20 dollars a month okay and then okay i don't do peer-to-peer -peer lending with keto okay so one of the other things that i do is i offer services okay if somebody wants to do a coaching call now it's not a coaching call with me it's a coaching call with the person that i partnered with and that's something that i think i make like uh, twenty dollars, fifteen dollars, something like that. They charge, I think it's forty-five or fifty uh, dollars, and I make fifteen per call, and it's a, it's an hour-long call, and they just talk about, you know, keto, getting into it, getting stuff ready, meal prep, stuff like that. Um, so it's more like a coaching service, and I think I make like fifteen dollars, um, a call. Okay, so this is kind of, this is again, this is an example. Um, and it is an actual live example of what I do for my weight loss channel. So inside this video, I talked about two different examples. One, I talked about the homemade entrepreneur channel. Okay, how to make money with affiliate marketing and core sales and and ebooks and going into peer-to-peer -peer lending. But I also do stuff like stock trading. I talk about other things as well. Again, these are just my top five. Okay, if you want to become uh, more financially secure, more financially stable. I highly recommend you introduce some type of passive income. It doesn't have to be YouTube, doesn't have to be courses, but it needs to be something that it doesn't rely on your work. Okay, so let's say I'm uh, sick for two weeks and I can't do anything, am I still gonna make money? Most people are gonna say no. Most people can't do that. And the reason why they can't do that is simply because they go to a nine to five job. They are on the computer, you know, doing work, you're know, doing uh, you know, data entry, doing freelance writing, whatever it is, and it requires them to be there, be present to make money. With YouTube, that's not always the case. You can start making money very quickly as long as you have the right videos, you're consistently uploading, you have a decent audience, and again, all that takes time. You have to build it, but once you build it, it's there, you can start to monetize that audience and your work and start to make some money, okay? So, one thing I just want you to understand is passive income. It is possible, but it does take work. I've been do I've been trying to create more passive income streams for the past 12, 13 years, and I've been I've been getting better at it. Some of my passive income streams I created 10 years ago, they're not still active. They're not still making me money. Other ones are. So just understand you're putting the work. Some of them are going to be evergreen. They're going to still make you money, and those are the ones you want. Other ones. They're gonna be more temporary. You can do the work, you can make a little bit of money, and that's gonna slowly die off. So just understand, passive income is possible, but you have to put in the work, all right? So if you have any questions, let me know. You can ask your questions down in the comment section below. I'll put a link to my 15 profitable passive income streams. It's a free guide, you can go download. I'll put a link to that down in the description box below as well. Go check it out. Again, give the video a thumbs up. If you enjoyed today's video, subscribe if you haven't done so already, and I'll see you guys on the next one.